You know, this was about the hottest weekend we've had so far this year, and we do have a break in the heat coming for tomorrow, and it's it's getting here because rain chances return. Now, nothing like we were getting last week, but we are talking about somewhere between 30 to 40 percent chance of a thunderstorm going on tomorrow, even in the morning hours, but especially in the afternoon. Then again on Tuesday with the better chance on Tuesday, these chances linger into Wednesday before disappearing, and we get right back to some hot, dry weather like we have been over the the weekend, but we have been seeing some strong thunderstorms already going on. Those thunderstorms are along a front that is slowly sagging its way in towards North Texas. The stronger thunderstorms clearly have been up into Oklahoma. You see all the lightning there, but we're also seeing a cluster of thunderstorms starting to form just on the other side of Young and Stevens counties. This also has a chance of maybe drifting into our western counties. The better threat really will be coming down from the north into our Red River County as we get into the evening hours in the overnight most of this will die out and then reform as we get into the day tomorrow so Monday starts with some storm chances they are far and few between don't change any plans in the morning hours just keep your eye to the sky especially as we get into the afternoon now we'll all enjoy temperatures in the 80s tomorrow instead of in the 90s, but pop up thunderstorms, a better chance will be wherever this front stalls out. We were talking about this yesterday, that the front coming through is going to stall somewhere over North Texas tomorrow, and wherever it stalls is the best chance of rain and thunderstorms. Now, it doesn't look like there's much of a severe weather threat with this or even a flooding threat, actually, but we'll keep an eye on all weather as it is that time of year where any thunderstorm can really get going. You can see that coming in from the west as we get overnight into Tuesday, we got another rain chance. This morphs into even a better chance Tuesday afternoon, which is probably the best chance all work week, Tuesday afternoon and evening for some thunderstorms around here. Again, let's address the risk of severe weather because after last week and all that severe weather we were getting it's it's a marginal risk tomorrow and just of those thunderstorms that develop out to the west and then on Tuesday which is our again our best chance of rain and thunderstorms there's a marginal risk of severe weather that's so that's one out of five as far as rainfall amounts not looking that generous maybe a little bit better rain amounts in our western counties as opposed to our eastern counties but again the flood threat doesn't look overwhelming right now it's 94 degrees feel like temperature in the upper 90s next three days well at least the next two we're going to be in the 80s with these good storm chances and probably slip back up to 90 by Wednesday but when those 90s return today was the sixth day in a row longest streak we got a longer streak coming and that's going to start I think as we get into Thursday with mid 90s we'll hit 90 on Wednesday but the really hot weather you see that high pressure dome that's been out to the southwest being record highs it moves right over us and that means the return of some hot weather there it is. As you can see those storm chances all piled up in the first couple days of your work week. And next weekend, Father's Day weekend, looking hot and dry.